Quarterfinal two match number two. Drivers behind the line. Ready. Three, two, one. Power up. And the teams are racing across the field. 118 trying to get that first cube on for blue, and they're able to. 33 also matching for the blue, for the red alliance. 118 successful placing a second. So is 33. Looks like 118's third cube auto did not work, but neither did red alliances. Both alliances were also able to score cubes on their switch during autonomous period. It is now tele-operated mode. We have two minutes left in these match, and both of these alliances are attacking the scale. Right now, the red alliance has control of their switch and of the scale. Blue alliance has control of their switch, and they are desperately fighting to gain control of the scale. 33, though, for the red alliance. They lost the last match. They don't want to lose this one. They are placing cube after cube on the scale in order to gain control. Engineers are joining them as well as as is their third partner, Celtex. However, Blue Alliance is not to be outdone. 118 is ripping up the field, as is their partner, Mars. They are racing across, going from human player station to human player station, and trying to gain control back of the scale. Right now, Blue Alliance has control of their own switch, but Red has taken control of the scale and of their own switch. We have just over a minute left in this match, and the Red Alliance has a sizable lead over the Blue Alliance. If that holds, we will be going to a rubber match for this matchup. However, a lot can change in the remaining minute. Blue Alliance just dropped not one, but two cubes off of the scale, which can be detrimental for this alliance at this point in the match. Red Alliance is consistently placing cube after cube on the scale, and they are solidifying their advantage. 1747 Harrison Boiler Robotics are now making sure that the Blue Alliance has control of their switch, and they're also feeding some cubes over to their partners who are working the scale for Blue. We have 30 seconds left in the match. It is now time for these teams to execute their end game strategy. 33 is extending their elevator all the way up. They've got their claw on the hook. Their partner, Celtech, is gonna try to hook on as well to get that double climb. While on the other side of the field, 1747 also has their hook on, and their partner, Mars, is going to also attack a double climb. Red Alliance has their climb and Blue Alliance is trying with three seconds left. Mars is gonna have to get up and unfortunately they didn't. We have a double climb for Red, a single climb for Blue. We will see if we're gonna be going to a rubber match or not momentarily. Just to recap, Blue won that first match. Red needs to win to stay alive. Let's see what the outcome is. Congratulations to the Red Alliance. We are going to a tiebreaker match. Red putting up a score of 421 to Blue's 208. These two alliances will be facing off to see who advances to the semifinals.